good trick, but <laughs> I guess you have to with two. <laughs> <laughs> Can you impersonate your coach? That would be my dad. <laughs> <laughs> maybe not right now. <laughs> maybe not. <laughs> well, my, my dad's favorite thing to say to me is take the ball early. And no matter how early I take the ball, he says take the ball early. And he keeps saying take it early and I don't know where I'm supposed to take this ball. <laughs> That's his favorite line to me. Funniest thing a ball kid has done during a match. Well, not during my match, but I think the other day, two days ago, when Nadal was playing, I think it was pretty funny when the ball kid tried to put the bottle back when his bottle fell because everyone knows how, uh, you know, how Rafa loves his bottles facing forwards. I think like the ball kid put it exactly the way he likes it, and I think, and I think that broke Rafa into smiles. I thought that was pretty cool. Favorite sport to watch on TV apart from tennis? I have to say cricket. I'm from India. I mean, there's no, there's no other. I can't say anything else. Most painful injury you've ever had? I think probably the most painful one was my wrist. And at one point I couldn't comb my hair or hold a, you know, a phone in my hand or even eat myself with my right hand. So playing tennis was really out of the question at that point. I thought I was going to retire. And for me, that was the most painful thing I've ever been through. Best thing about playing? Doubles over singles. Mm, you always have someone else to blame. <laughs> I, think, <laughs> I think that's pretty good. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, um, I mean, to be very honest, I think it's, uh, you know, physically not as demanding. And that's why, like for me, after my three surgeries, that's the reason I moved. But I still miss singles so much. But um, yeah, du playing doubles, I think, you know, you have less court to cover. I'll take that. Give us your best Aussie accent. <laughs> um, how are you, mate? <laughs> That's pretty good. That's not bad. What do you do when you're not playing tennis? I sleep when I'm not playing tennis. I love to sleep and I love to sit in my pajamas all day and not do any physical activity. You have a huge fan following. What would you like to say to them? Well, I'd like to say thanks for following me for all these years. It's been great. It helps that you come from a country of 1.2 billion people. So, uh, yeah, and uh, hopefully I have a few more years of tennis left in me.